One of the uh, one of the uh, things that this crisis has taught us, sir, is that we are dangerously over dependent on a global supply chain for our medicines like penicillin, our medical supplies like masks, and our medical equipment like ventilators. We have right now, as we speak, over 50 countries have already imposed some forms of export restrictions in their country against the rest of the world. And what, we've, what we're learning from that is that no matter how many treaties you have, no matter how many alliances, no matter how many phone calls, uh, when push comes to shove, you run the risk as a nation of not having what you need. And if there's any vindication of the president's buy American, secure borders, and a strong manufacturing base, philosophy, strategy, and belief, it is this crisis, because it underscores everything that we see there. So the buy American order, which, which is going through process, would do, do a couple things. It would simply say, not during this crisis, because we don't want to disrupt anything. I want to be really clear about that. But going forward, after this is over, the VA, DOD, HHS, and this government buys American for essential medicines, our medical countermeasures, and the medical supplies and equipment we need. At the same time, it will deregulate so we can get the FDA and EPA to facilitate domestic manufacturing and then innovate. Because the key here, the key here is having advanced manufacturing on U.S. soil that can leapfrog other countries so we don't have to worry about competing against cheap sweatshop labor, lax environmental regulations, different tax regimes, uh, and the massive subsidies of foreign governments who are actually directly attacking our industrial base. So be patient with that, sir. Uh, it's, it's the other priorities we have right now or the DPA and what, what the task force is doing. But if we learn anything from this crisis, it should be never again. Never again should we have to depend on the rest of the world for our essential medicines and countermeasures.